Oh, look, Eloisa, Isabella's coming. Does she have to use so many flowers? Did somebody say flowers? Isabella, that's a lot of flowers you have on yourself. I know, isn't it great? Yeah, greatest thing in the world. I hear sarcasm in your voice. Anyway, just wanted to ask you girls a question. Oh, what is it? Do you need more flowers for a bouquet? No. More flower vines to swing on? No. I want to make some jewelry. Okay, let's go. Taboo fans, today we are making pendant jewelry. Here's everything you're going to need. Awesome. We've got 18 pendants and they're different sizes that we can pick from. Whoa, this one looks like a mirror kind of. It's an oval shape. We've got a heart, square, circle a flower look we even get a key we can create along with the pendants we have glass gems that go on top these help the image to pop out these are really cool of course we have glue to stick them on we've got necklaces and bracelets to put our pendants on and look at all of these letters that we can cut out we also get some images we can color and then images that are already colored. Whoa, there's so many awesome ones. Cool, look at these emojis. I'm feeling silly today, but we're not using any of these images because we are making Encanto inspired jewelry. So I'm gonna bring out Encanto images. I have some really fun ones. We've got Antonio, Dolores, Mirabel on her accordion, Louisa carrying some buckets and some birds. Also the colorful Isabella. So first things first, let's pick out a pendant. I wanna do a heart one. And let's pick a heart glass gem. I'm totally gonna do Mirabel. So we're gonna put the glass gem right over it. And you're gonna go ahead and trace around. Now let's cut it out. Here's our Mirabel and her accordion in a heart shape. I'm gonna take my glue and we're gonna put it all over the pendant right here and put your image right on top. Press it down. Whoa, I think I put way too much glue there. And now I'm gonna put, I'm just gonna put a little bit of glue because last time we put a whole bunch. And we're gonna put our glass pendant right on top of the glue there and just kind of press it down. And I'm just gonna get rid of any excess glue. Cool, now we have a Mirabel pendant. I'm gonna put this to the side. I'm gonna do a bigger one this time. Should we do like an oval or maybe let's do a square one. The picture I've chosen is Mirabel and Louisa. We're gonna put the square glass gem right on top. Trace around the image, cut it out. This time I'm gonna put a very small amount of glue. Go ahead and put your image right on top and little small dollops of glue on like all the sides. Glass gem going on top. I feel like this one's gonna be my favorite. Here's our Mirabel and Louisa. I'm gonna put this one to dry. I'm gonna pick a flower one. Since butterflies love flowers, I'm gonna do this butterfly. Let's see if I can fit it on here. And trace it around. Little bit of glue. Let's see if this is gonna fit in here. And glue on top. Perfect. Oh, we've got a butterfly. Up next, I totally want to do Dolores. I'm going to use an oval pendant. La 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 la. Just like we're before. Put that on there. Put it right on there. I'm telling you, these look so cool once the glass gem sits on top of the image. I'm doing one more pendant and guess where this candle is going to go? Since Grandma Alma always carries around keys, I'm going to put it on this big key pendant. This gem right on top. This is gonna look really awesome, you guys. Some of our pendants have already dried, so let's go ahead and make some jewelry out of them. We've got two bags here. We've got necklaces in this one and bracelets in this one. I'm gonna do some necklaces. So let's go ahead and take out these beaded ones. They are pretty long. I'm gonna take this one of Mirabel and Louisa. Two sisters. Let's go ahead and put it through the hole right here and go ahead and secure that. And now we have a really cool pendant necklace. I'm gonna add another one to our group of pendants. This is Isabella. Let's make Mirabelle's. For hers, we're gonna do a bracelet. Let's put that through. This is a lot shorter. Let's see how well it fits around the wrist. For my daughters, I'm gonna make it a little bit shorter, but this is what it looks like so far. 
it's so cool. Let me take this key. I'm also gonna make this into a bracelet. All right, last one going on. Here are all of our pendant jewelry. Which one's your favorite? I'm going between Mirabel and Louisa, and this Isabella one. I'm gonna go ahead and put these on my daughter. Let's go. All right, here's our first necklace. What do you think? Good. Now let's put this bracelet on you. It's Alma's key with the candle. All right, Caboodle fans, I have decorated our dolls with our pendant jewelry. I hope you guys love these DIY pendants. Have a fabulous day, and of course, stay sweet.